All right, so with the 133rd pick in the 2023 NFL Draft, the Chicago Bears select Tyler Scott, wide receiver out of Cincinnati, and this is pretty much a Darna Mooney clone. If you take a look at the two guys, they're pretty much the same stature, same traits, and they were both late round picks. Now you can never have too many receivers, especially for the Bears, who even though we did sign DJ Moore this offseason or trade for DJ Moore, and we did trade for uh, Chase Claypool, and we still have Darnell Mooney, we still need depth. And I actually pre predicted that we were going to do this. So uh, Tyler Scott, man, he's actually pretty decent. I'm not going to lie. I really like him on his, on his tape. He looks great. He's very fast, very fast B, just like Darnell Mooney of uh, great acceleration, great burst. And as soon as he has the ball in his hands, man, he is just like Sonic, just zero to hundred real quick, just straight line speed. Absolutely amazing. And I believe all of his touchdowns in college, I was reading something on this. All of his touchdowns in college were from 20 yards out or longer. So he's definitely that deep threat receiver that fits Justin Fields play style perfectly. I mean, we know Justin Fields to be a deep ball guy. He loves taking the shots down the field. And for a guy like Tyler Scott, this is a perfect receiver for Justin Fields to be able to go and take the top off the defense and just add another speed demon to this offense. And like I said, all the help that Justin Fields can get will be very helpful, very useful. You can never have too many receivers on a team. So going over a couple things about Tyler Scott here, he is 5'11", 185 pounds. He appeared in 30 games in three seasons with the Bearcats. So he actually goes from being a Cincinnati Bearcat to a Chicago Bear. So I like that. He caught 87 passes for 1,439 yards and 14 touchdowns. So like I said, very fast. He's a speedy receiver. So this kind of addresses the position of need. Not too much. Obviously, receiver isn't our weakest point anymore like it was last season, but it still helps. So I really like this pick. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments down below, and I'm out.